Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hope you guys are all doing well. Today's video I have for you is my favourite dunk pickup of this year. Probably my favourite dunk pickup I've had for a very, very long time. Obviously, as you already know, dunks are one of my favourite silhouettes. So when I saw this pair, I felt like I just needed it. So it is actually a size exclusive with Nike. For those of you that don't know, or maybe are not from the UK, size is kind of like a streetwear company, I would say. Um, and they kind of do raffles for kind of all the normal Jordans, Yeezys, that kind of thing. Um, so they did a collaboration with Nike to produce some dunks. And let me tell you, they are stunning. So here they are. Now look how beautiful they are. They are i just feel like they look so different so the official colorway is brown slash sand and um, so we'll get kind of into the details about this shoe because there is a lot of features about this dunk um, and i think that's what makes it so so good so taking a closer look into the shoe as you can see most of the shoe i would say is made up of this leather um, which is kind of normal standard for a dunk but we have this fuzzy suede material which is not normal for a normal dunk and this is in the tan color colorway as you can see it's on the toe box the quarter panels and towards the back as well absolutely love this i feel like this is probably one of the main reasons why i actually love this shoe is because of the material i feel like it's not kind of standard for a normal dunk and then as you can see we have this blue swoosh as well it's such a vibrant blue that contrasts completely to the shoe this is also made up in a kind of suede material it feels very similar to the fuzzy suede material but it's a bit less fuzzy if that makes sense sense and then as you can see around it we have this stitching which I absolutely love as well I feel like it just completes the whole look and then as I said we have this leather as well this is kind of a darker version of this tan colorway and moving towards the back of the shoe we have this heel overlay with the logo this is actually in green as well I feel like that's quite interesting because there's nothing else green on this shoe but it contrasts nicely it works and because I feel like it's a heel overlay you know it's not a huge feature of the shoe if we move back around to the front of the shoe laces we kind of have this rope material and as you can see it's a mixture of colors absolutely love the laces on the tongue as well we have a very very different tongue to normal dunks this tongue is very very interesting because we have the fuzzy suede and we have the leather a mixture of both of the materials of this shoe we then have this orange tongue tag which is not a normal tongue tag we are used to seeing obviously the normal tongue tag usually is stitched on here this one is only stitched on one side and it kind of flaps and it is bright orange which i absolutely love i feel like that stands out completely and then if we actually look at the actual tongue as you can see you can see the foam which is giving me off-white vibes i actually have the off-white dunks here and as you can see literally that is like the same thing so you can actually see the foam and the stitching isn't you know completed which i absolutely love it kind of gives it that rustic kind of vibe and obviously an off-white vibe if we take a look into the shoe we have the sail lining and inside we have the orange with the pop of black as well a nice contrast and matches this little tongue tag here if we go on to the midsole again we have this sail colorway but if you can actually notice as well we do have this black stitching which goes through usually the stitching is in the same color as the midsole so it kind of blends in if we move to the actual sole we have this speckled gray i'm pretty sure that this is probably part of the nike sustainability movement and um, because usually every time i see speckled it's because it's made out of recycled material but the speckles on this is barely noticeable and um, you literally could not see far away it literally just looks like gray are a size collaboration these came out on the size app they came out as a raffle so you had to enter um super super lucky and grateful that i was able to pick these up they came out at 110 pounds which is kind of standard for a normal dunk so you would be looking at resale if you were buying these resale is actually quite high i'd say about double so you will be paying double around the 200 region for these obviously depending what size you are um but i definitely totally think they are worth it i feel like you're getting something premium for 
standard price of a dunk um, and they definitely look expensive like they look cool they look edgy they look unique um, in terms of sizing I go true to sizing all my dunks they literally fit like a normal dunk they feel the same as a normal dunk there isn't really anything different in terms of comfortability they literally fit exactly the same as a normal dunk so if you were looking to pick them up go for your normal true to size overall I'm so so happy I managed to pick these up and I literally cannot wait to wear them I will do an on foot video for you guys as well so you can see what they look like let me know what you guys think about these thank you guys so much for watching today's video and I'll see you guys next time Thank you.